Hey everyone, this is Samlock24 and today we're going to be talking about the, I guess, the new dual quest that they added to Duel Links and also the leaks that uh, uh, that were up on uh, duellinks.gameA.co uh, with the new, I guess it's going to be the next or the 16th main uh, box, Blackstone Rising. Uh, let's go ahead and talk about the event first and then we'll go ahead and get into leaks. Um, Alright, so the basically it's a dual meter, I don't know why they decided to change it up, I think. Uh, the dual meter was fine. Uh, it says for today only you will obtain 20 points as a bonus score if you play dual quest in addition. The appearance rate of gems will increase. Uh, I guess it's a decent way to get some gems, but again, it's the same thing as a dual meter. There's really nothing uh, that changed. I, I thought they were going to do something like the RPG that they did last time, which again, uh, I didn't like at all. It was just pointless. Uh, basically rolling a dice, I guess this is somewhat the same you just don't have to roll the dice uh anyway the rewards aren't really that good uh gold treasure box again it's they should have just done a dual meter thing like they always do uh this monster can be special summoned from the graveyard to destroy one face down defense position uh since its original attack and defense will be switched make sure to special summon the monster in attack position so uh, again overall it's not a, a great card i don't think uh, might be decent in a rock deck, but I really don't see it doing much of anything uh, for the world treasure boxes. I'm not really sure if they're going to put different type of cards in treasure boxes. I highly doubt it. I haven't seen anything in that maybe 150 uh, so far, so not that that high. But um, anyway, they're going to give us a remove trap, which uh, we all should have at least like at least three. Uh, and then... Magno Drago, it's an okay card, I guess. Uh, Gift of the Mystical, oh, extremely useless. Sonic Jammer, uh, I guess the only good thing about it is the gems, and that's basically about it. And there's a Sand Moth, and then a Mad Sword Beast, which I think it's a little too late. Uh, Draconic Guard, again, it's really, it, it, they're okay cards, I guess. And then we'll also get a, a Sleeve Dual Quest, so... Overall, I think the uh, the whole thing is just it it's not that good. It's just basically another dual meter. Uh, they just decided to add uh, B one thirty sixes or whatever <laughs> on here. But uh, anyway, when it comes to the the leak of the sixteen main uh, Blackstone Rising, uh, let me go ahead and just get on to some auto duelings so you guys have something to see. And I think. Uh, next time I'll go ahead and add pictures, but today I, I just ran out of time and I didn't have the time to do it. But anyway, Blackstone Rising, the main card on it, it's uh, Blackwing Dragon, which it's a decent card. I don't think it's gonna be doing much of anything. Uh, the better card in the uh, in the boxes are uh, Secret to Armor, Black Whirlwind, and Card of Consonance, along with the uh, the Dragoonity Archetype. I think that's basically what you want to be going for. Um, and I think that's basically the only decent thing that's in the box. Um, I don't think Secret to Armor is going to see that much play. Uh, we do have Widespread Ruin and not that many people are using it. Uh, and Widespread Ruin doesn't target Secret to Dust. Uh, and, but you can also select which monster gets destroyed with Secret to Armor. So you can kind of let your opponent attack with a low attacking monster or a monster that maybe you want uh, to fake uh, that you don't have anything. Uh, I don't know, or bluff, or it might bring like a little bit more of maybe uh, a little bit more skill to the game, but that I really highly doubt it. Um, if there is a lot of secret to armors and widespread ruins going around, then I think Jinso might, might start to see some gameplay. But uh, other than that, I, I don't know about, about it. And I think secret to armor is one of the better cards in the box. Uh, Black Whirlwind, of course, it's going to be a really good card. It's kind of a it's going to be extremely hard to get it, seeing that it's an ultra rare. I think they should have made it a super rare, but then again, if it was a super rare, everyone was going to be playing it. Uh, it's kind of unfair for free-to-play players, though. Uh, if they want to play Black Rowland, they will have to drop some cash on, uh, on Duel Links or uh, save up a ton of gems for it. Uh, card of Consonance, I think it's, actually, it's a really good card, especially with Dragoonities. Uh, being able to ditch a phalanx basically for free and then summon uh well what, what was it ducks it's and give you a free synchro summon i think it's gonna be good and i, I think with um with dragoonity night badge rihanna i think uh, there is gonna be some people that are 
gonna be getting OTK'd and I think this is gonna be one of the most played synchro base deck uh, in my opinion uh, Dragoonity Rajriano it's actually really decent uh, and it I think of the TCG I did used to play and I think I still have the entire deck somewhere uh, in a box uh, I think it's like a I got a, like all highest rarities for it but uh, you can make a ton of OTKs with it uh, another ultra breaker the magical warrior I think we should have gone breaker uh, a long long time ago uh, at this point it's still gonna be played I think since there's not that many spell and trap destruction so uh, it is gonna be a decent card but it's not gonna uh, be as useful as it would have been if they released it like maybe five boxes ago uh, and then the next one like, of course we're getting bore of the spear and then Reptilian Vasky, which Reptilians, I don't think they're going to do much of anything. Uh, maybe just a gimmicky deck, uh, if anything. Uh, and then, let's see what else for the super rares. Of course, Dragoonity Ducks, Failings, uh, Blackwing Armwing, which I think it's a little bit better than the, uh, the than the Blackwing Dragon. The, and also, we're getting Dragoonity Knight, Gay, Dark. And let me switch this deck out here for a beat deck. Uh, all right, so uh, well, what else? Okay, so sure, the blue flame is actually it's an, a, a, an extremely good addition to the black wind deck, especially since we're getting black whirlwind, and a black whirlwind plus a sure, uh, it's it's gonna give you a ton of advantage. Um, I don't know if we have the uh, the I guess the uh, the honest black wind yet, but once that gets released, uh, it's gonna be a really good combo. Uh, then for we're also getting Harpy Queen, which again it's kind of late. Uh, Bujinji Crane, Crane's gonna be. Uh, it might make uh, Bujins kind of viable, maybe, but I, uh, again I don't know. And then Harpy's Hunting Ground, which again, extremely late to the party. Uh, for the rares, let's see. Dragoonity Knight Barcha, decent. Okay, Dragoonity Knight Trident, and then. The other Dragoonity, I think that's going to be seeing play Dragoonity Knight Ga Gaibolg, I think. Dragoonity Aklus, which is not going to see that much play. Uh, Partisan, Dragoonity Armor Mistletane. Uh, Reptilian Hydron, let's see what else. Reptilian Medusa, Blackwing Silverwind, The Ascendant, which is going to be super hard to summon in Duel Links. Uh, Blackwing Kagarashi, The Wanderer. Uh, Tornado, The Reverse Wind, and then Breeze of Zephyr. Blackwing Gladius, the Midnight Sun, Blackwing Gust, the Backblast, and uh, let's see, and Mister the Silver Shield, and oh, we're, getting, we're getting a Gladiator Beast, Gaia Dice. I don't remember that Gladiator Beast. Let's let me read into this. Gaia Dice, Gladiator Beast, Sp Spartacus, and Gladiator Beast uh, Monster. This card can only be special summoned from the extra deck by returning the above cards you control to the deck. You do not use polymerization. When this card destroys a monster by battle and sends it to the graveyard and inflict damage to your point equal to the effect of the destroyed monster. So it's a piercing card. Um, I'm not sure that it's going to be, it's going to see any play because you do have to have a specific uh, card and that being Spartacus. Spartacus it's not really running gladiator beast so don't really see it doing much of anything uh, okay let me go back here all right so gladiator beast hopoma gladiator beast samurite isanagi synchro blast wave cards of black feathers and dragonity divine lance okay so the cards that you need to be looking for again it's basically most of the ultra rares the secret to armor I think it's going to be uh, good with uh, or basically good against everything. Black Rule Wins, if you're going to run uh, Black Wings. And then you might have to buy Silver Boxes if you, if you want to run like a full blown Dragoonity deck. And I think uh, Dragoonities do have the ability to become like a high tier, maybe one and a half to one, uh, just depending on the build that gets run. If it's like a, an OTK version, I, I do see it being extremely good with three card of consonants and the three phalanx and then the three ducks. Uh, it's just going to be extremely, extremely fast and you're just going to be able to deal a ton of damage. Uh, again, I think one of the, uh, I think maybe a uh, a windstorm 
Uh, enemy controllers are going to see way more play. <laughs> enemy controllers do see a ton of play anyways. Uh, but maybe a, uh, a Curse of Anubis, a Sphere Karibu, so I'm going to start seeing a lot of play because uh, the Dragoonity Vajriana is going to be doing a ton of damage, uh, especially if you don't stop it. It's gonna, it's almost, it, it almost does uh, a no TK by itself. It's 1900, and the fact that it can attack twice, I mean, it's just going to be ridiculous. So, uh, hope I'll be looking, <laughs> or if you're going to spend some gems, I think Dragoonity would be the a good synchro deck um, again we do had just have to wait and see how uh, how good it is in, in dueling so I do expect it to be really good since you're gonna have a ton of draw support and you're gonna be able to get the uh, the phalanxes extremely uh, to the graveyard extremely fast I can see people running maybe a uh, a card trooper or something of the like but uh, anyways I think we're gonna go ahead and leave it there for today uh, again I do apologize I, I didn't have any pictures on here but I just ran out of time and it's kind of late, it's 11.04, so I'm going to go ahead and leave it there. If you have any questions or comments, do leave them in the comment section below. And if you are enjoying this video, go ahead and leave a like. Um, and if you do enjoy my content, do subscribe and uh, I'll see you guys next time.